During designing of the up-to-date devices, a developer faces the problem of providing a reserve or autonomous power supply for his device. As a rule, depending on energy consumption manner and tasks, as in this case, we use electrolytic capacitors, accumulators or batteries. However, the application of the above devices or their combinations does not always accomplish the given task due to specification of each device. In this very case, it is relevant to use ionisters. Ionisters are electromechanical components intended for storing electric power. They have a number of advantages in comparison with the listed devices. This is a wide temperature range, big capacity, high insulation resistance, long service life. There is no need to control the charging process up to several tens of thousand charge-discharge cycles. Ionisters are used in personal computers, phones, pagers, organizers, clocks and similar devices as a reserve power supply unit, which provides for the memory when the batteries are being changed. One more application area of ionisters is energy storages in autonomous power supply systems with sun batteries or wind motors. Recently, there has been a tendency to use ionisters in combination of accumulators in the systems of complex dynamic energy consumption. These are pagers, cell phones, for short time supplying of high load current. Ionisters are known in the foreign literature as supercapacitors and ultracapacitors. They are a relatively new generation of electrochemical energy storages where electric double layer is used. According to the energy density and access speed to the memory, they have the intermediate position between electrolytic capacitors and small accumulators. Our range is represented by the ionisters manufactured by Panasonic in two series. HG and AL series with vertical and horizontal leads and with radial leads with capacity from 0.022 to 10 farads, rated for the voltage from 2.5 to 5.5 volts. So we can say that an ionister is a big capacity in small housing and many other advantages.